friends and neighbors welcome to another production <coughs> of the program here we are on TV uh, once again once a day every day turn on the machines and live forever here we go I'm alive and I uh, made it all the way back down here and to the basement from upstairs oh uh, what a life viewers what a life and what a world uh you know my friends out there in tv land thank you for joining me in this very difficult time things aren't getting easier uh <laughs> right it's uh it's a new day though. New day, new nightmare. You know, it's kind of lame talking about your dreams, but the um, the virus has seeped into my dreams, and it's like every time it's like because it can end any dream. So it's like every every dream you have, you're doing some one thing, and then you're like, whoa, what is this scenario? This scenario is not right because I should be at home and not doing anything. So before, like in the before times, is like you're having some kind of dream, and then it could be like this is kind of weird, but um, you know it could go anywhere. It can, it can conclude in any way. But I've been finding myself being like, I should be at home right now. Why? Why am I around? Like, why am I in any any situation other than just not leaving the house? So it's uh, it's time. It's it's a t it's the time of the of the world. Viewers, I don't know if you're feeling the same kind of thing. Uh, yesterday, I did the program at about 8:45, and uh, then on that was on a Tuesday, and then I went to work for a bit, and it's spreading. Virus is spreading everywhere, and then I went to uh, uh, I came back home, and I did some sitting. I sat in the sun for a little bit. Came out here doing this thing. Uh, I'm getting on the Zoom right now. See if anybody's on here. You can get on here. It's uh, the link is on YouTube. Uh oh. <laughs> We're on the YouTube live streaming, but the link for this thing is on uh, the the uh, the website. Looks like we got some voicemail from Mr. Ginsu. Let's see what Mr. Ginsu is going to say today. I got to get this thing plugged in. So we listen. To, I'll play, start playing this message. I'm going to go grab this plug. I just heard on the radio some kind somewhere is thinking that I'm not sure if it's in religious schools or what that they're taking away birth control pills now who in the fuck You people are just like the people that took my woman away from me, and I ought to slit every one of your fucking people's throats, you stupid fuckstick motherfuckers. Who the fuck do you think you are? It's against the political. Fuck you. Go fuck yourself. One of these days, I might just fuck you. What? Or I might not. Well, I might make you fuck that one over there. Because you guys look alike. Act alike. Or just alike. Mm -hmm. And then you going to have to have her, his baby. Because you didn't take birth control pills, you stupid son of a bitch. 
Jesus. <laughs> yeah, I'm going to find them people. I'm going to make them get pregnant. One way or the other. <laughs> Brush on my bippo, I'm a magician. Now, I don't have to get them pregnant with my baby. I just have to get them pregnant with somebody else's baby. So, <laughs> <fuck you>. uh, <laughs> you know, I think some of what you said is okay, but <laughs> some of it was pretty weird. Uh -huh. Mr. Kinsey's got a heart of gold, though. I think his message is right, but then he wants to, well... I think the vengeance is vengeance is a little dark for my taste. I'm gonna call him back though. Maybe he hasn't been able to answer though because of his uh, uh, nobody's. He can't get reception. Oh, looks like Freddy's getting on the Zoom though. Maybe. Yes, maybe indeed. Hey, Freddie. <laughs> True. Hi. Hi, how are ya? I'm doing pretty good. I've had dreams also uh, infected by the virus. Yeah? But you're like, oh, I'm not supposed to be here. It's not every dream, but some of them I'm like, whoa, what the heck? This is not, like, there's way too many people here. <laughs> yeah. Like, it's not like nobody's social distancing. Yeah. It's not like every dream, but it's just like at the end. <laughs> it's just like it could end any dream, though. Like, like oh, yeah. what, whatever you're yeah. doing, it's just like you can suddenly realize, like, where are you? Some, like, like I had like a dream that someone, like, I was like talking to somebody, and then they they were like blowing in my face, and I was like, oh. wait a minute, what are you doing? <laughs> like at first it was okay, <laughs> yeah. So it, it's it's in there now. It's like any situation, like, or you just like. Any dream you have just like ends, oh yeah, it's been end towards some, at some point you're like, I gotta get home. What am I doing out here? So, yeah, too much. And then Stella, Stella was watching or is watching on YouTube as well. So, um, shout out, shout out to Stella. Yeah, but also she said some uh, mask dreams. On the YouTube channel comments there on the live chat. Mass streams? Yeah, chat streams. Are you saying mask? Did you say mask dream? Mask dreams on the chat stream. <laughs> mask dreams on the chat streams. <laughs> yeah. Wow. Yeah. Uh, it's like hard to know, and it's like some people are doing things like one thing and then um other people i talked to my father my father just says wear just wear your mask and your face shield and you'll be fine which is probably probably true i mean that's probably true i did hear about um like this hair salon where like both hair salon ladies who were cutting people's hair like tested positive for the covid mm -hmm. and then but they'd been wearing masks the whole time, and all of their, uh, all of the people who came in to get the haircut, also wore masks the whole time, and none of the people who got haircut tested positive. Like yeah. they were fine. Like like the, the ladies who were cutting hair, the hairstylist, got it somewhere else, you know, or, or whatever, and yeah. had it, or and, but didn't pass it on because of masks. Oh, that's good. <laughs> so, so, but... <laughs> I know people are like, when are you gonna um, you're just gonna live in your like the basement? When are you gonna start living your life? I'm like, in about five months. <laughs> but they're I'm like, but they're like, no, no. What do you mean? What? That's not a. I'm like, I have an actual answer for you. But uh, yeah, they don't want the actual answer. Um, I'm gonna call Mr. Ginsu. Yeah, he's gonna get somebody pregnant. He said. Yeah, he was like, he, he, he was like, he was like, I heard that people are trying to legislate against birth control, and I don't like that. And I was like, oh, that sounds good. I'm gonna solve <laughs> 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 them. Like, 
Yeah. Is that somebody there? Is it a YouTube bummer? I think we might. Or a... it's, it's Mike Aki. Oh. What are you? Are you on a you're on a weird surface, huh? Uh yeah, I'm on a weird. I'm standing in front of a like crazy wall. Let's go. Hey, Mr. Gintu, you answered. Oh shit. <laughs> Has a run outside. Oh yeah, I'm I'm uh, uh, surprised that when you're actually there now. Yep, I'm here. How are Barely. you? I'm okay. I'm still here. Yeah, yeah, me too. I hear that. Oh. Um, you still in your basement? I'm still in the basement. I'm alive. I'm, That's all about. How many times? Time, how many times you been out? I mean, I'm going to I'm I'm going to work, but that's it. That's it. Yeah. Uh, that's okay. Yep. I'm not going to yeah, stores. I'm not going anywhere else. So. Not that's where, pretty much what I do. Yeah. Nowhere. Go nowhere. Yeah, but you were already doing that, weren't you? Yeah, I kind of was. Yeah. Fucking <laughs> sorry. I guess nothing changed. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I I had a, like a somewhat active social life, <laughs> like, and now I, now I'm living a Mr. Ginsu life. Yeah, that's right. Yeah, that's right, man. Everybody gets to live like me. Yeah, you and Mark. I was always telling people like, don't do that. Go do things. Live your life. And now I'm like, don't live your life. <laughs> don't live your life. <laughs> that's right. Don't 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 do it. Don't live your life. Like, when are you going to go and start living your life? Like, never. Don't do that. Why would you want to do that? <laughs> Not for a couple of years. Somebody offered you a modeling gig? Wait. Who was that? Was and that Freddy? Said that? I don't know. And you, uh, and you took it? I'm trying to get out here. I keep, everyone keeps glitching out and freezing. You got a modeling gig? <sighs> Oh, no. I mean, almost. Somebody wanted me to be a model. Like your friend? <laughs> At work. Someone like gave oh, me Oh, yeah. Work. Not like an agent. Not like, somebody like, stopped you on the... Freddy's on the, on the Zoom, Mr. Gintu. Somebody stopped you on the street and said, Hey, have you ever thought about being a model? Like, that, that sounds like they're going to... Uh, like, if they did that, that's like the, the road to like a prostitution ring to me. <laughs> <laughs> like... <laughs> That's a legit, I mean, you know. But not if it's your friend. If it's your friend, that's okay. Industry. But if it's just like some <laughs> random person, they're like, you ever thought it about pic getting person, your pictures yeah, they're taken? They're going to cut my hair and have me model. Yeah, that sounds good if you know them already. If it's like somebody on the street, I would think they kind of sound more like a... No, I didn't know them. They were like a stranger customer. Oh, really? Wow. Well, maybe it was... Really... I, I probably would have done it too, but the virus. Yeah. So, I can do anything. What are you doing, Mr. Ginsu? I'm sitting here listening to you, Freddy. Yeah. <coughs> oh. You're, uh... Oh, you can't watch the program, huh? You haven't watched it at all? Not lately. So Jesus you, Christ. Yeah, if you want to listen to me and Freddy, you can watch the program because we're, uh, it's on... I don't even... I don't even... I can't get the internet. I can't get it at work, can't get it at the library, can't get it nowhere. Why not? What? I, I don't know what the fuck's wrong with my phone. You have a smartphone? It won't. It won't. It's a smartphone. Hmm. It just you gotta get a new phone, Mr. Gunn. You can get it for like a hundred bucks. Huh? Get a new phone. Freddie says get a new phone. Is that so? Uh, okay. You get a new phone for like less than a hundred bucks. You probably traded it to a carrier. Yeah, get a phone, uh, trade in your phone and get a new one, and maybe the reception is because... Well, but your uncle can't get reception either, right? Yeah, my both phones are kind of fucked, except for um, my tablet doesn't even get good reception either. Your tablet something has... Like that. Maybe you got, like, lead in your walls or something. Say what? You got lead in your walls? Um, no. Well, they're made of metal. Maybe, why don't you just get, buy the internet for your home, I guess. <laughs> um, no, I don't make that much money. Yeah. Tell your uncle. That's one bill I don't want to freaking start. Quit smoking cigarettes and pay for the internet instead of probably pay off the, the phone bill. 
Yeah, cigarettes cost more than internet, that's for sure. Or get your uncle to pay it, but uh, what, how's your uncle? How's that going? Um, he noticed something about the toilet paper around here. Oh, <laughs> uh, yeah? What about it? He says his toilet paper disappears and mine don't. Yeah, is he using it more? No. Yeah, he, yeah. <laughs> That's what he said. Something of that nature. He's like, what, what? the fuck? I'm is, like, is it because of like, rabbit turds? I guess. Uh, I don't. Wipe <laughs> my ass with a fucking half a roll or nothing. Yeah, I heard. Th- I heard that you are very conservative when it comes to toilet paper. <laughs> I don't know why I know that. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I figured you and me talking about freaking toilet paper was what started everybody freaking buying toilet paper. Yeah, everybody's buying the toilet paper, but um, why why is your uncle like even like keeping stock of like your toilet paper and his toilet paper? Say what? Why is your uncle like even? I don't know either, um, but he noticed that mine was not really disappearing. Oh yeah, he's oh, like no no, he had several rolls. Like, hey, I got um, something to say about our our comparative yeah, toilet paper consumption. Yeah, the less roll. He went, what the fuck? Is that the same roll sitting there, motherfucker? You don't, you have you have two rolls, so you, like, in your bathroom, you have two rolls sitting there, and one is yours and one is his? That's right. Most people, I think, would just use the same roll. Wait, well, in the same bathroom? Somewhere in that, um, yeah. can't find toilet paper nowhere. Um, he went and got some toilet paper, and then he was just using his, and I was just using mine. He just I fell guess. into it. Huh? You grab like a like a double roll roller there, or like you gotta like, or do you have, or they just like stuck somewhere? Yeah. Do you, who uses the the roller that's like installed in the the wall? Uh, that'd be me. And then where is his? And his out on top of the washer dryer. Or whatever. Did, oh. Maybe he brought it up because uh, he thought maybe you were using his. You think that's what it was? I was not using his. But maybe he thought you were. No. He didn't think yeah. I was. I How wasn't using no I'm like curious about this conversation. Coming yeah, up. The, wa- the washer and dryer is in the bathroom? That's correct. So, yeah, what did, why did he bring it? He's just like, hey, I got, I got something to say about the toilet paper. Or it was just coming up in... Uh, he said, what the fuck? You don't use any toilet paper? I'm like, not really. <laughs> Who's that? You got, that's... Arrington's not happy about the toilet paper conversation we're having. With the musical instrument walking by? Yeah, sorry. Yeah. sorry. I'm Arrington's so very sleep? sorry. I didn't even mean to bring it up except for I thought you'd be in uh, for, for a minute. Uh, I think... Oh, you're maybe in the Zoom picture. You want to get in the picture? I can't. It's like a, over here. That's how it's going with my uncle being here. There. So. That's nice. It sounds good, Arrington. I like that. All right. Uh oh. <laughs> Mr. Uh, uh. Oh, yeah, you didn't get in the crozine. Crozine number two. Mr. Ginsu fell off the phone. Yeah. Somebody told me Crozine sounds like something you would put in your eyes, like a medication. <laughs> Crozine, yeah, it sounds like a product. Wow, it's... I uh, went bandana shopping. Wow, that's cool. Where? Uh, in Portland, at the Arco, on uh, Rosa Parks. Look, it's, Whoa, it's, what's a, the it's a Mary. Mary who? Virgin Mary. This is actually Virgin de Guadalupe. Oh. Uh, but it's got the American flag. Yeah. Uh, it's got the Mexican flag over here. Mexican flag, American flag, Guadalupe, Statue of Liberty.
<laughs> That's a funny face. Yeah. <laughs> Wow. Yay. Oh, um, I know I'm going to miss the Ginsu. Let's see, where is this? Oh, there it is. I'm going to call Mr. Ginsu back again. Maybe his reception. Whoa, what is that? A crow? That's a cat, oh, huh? That's a cat. What's the cat's name? Yeah, the cat. <laughs> What's the cat's name? The cat's up on the. That's Flower the cat. Flower. 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 Oh, she's jumping. Don't jump, Flower. Oh. oh. Don't jump. I, mean, I guess she can jump. Oh, there she goes. <laughs> Hello. Cute. Yep, yep. What happened? We got dropped. Oh, uh, yeah, you got lost reception, huh? Yeah. Uh, maybe you didn't like the flute. Do what? Did you hear the flute? Something about a flute? A flute, a flute, like a whistle, flute thing. What are you doing with your flute? Somebody, <laughs> somebody, somebody came by with a flute, and they were playing the flute, and I thought you were like, no. Nope. Oh, no, I never fucking... Uh, you didn't notice the flute? Right. Um... What I would say, what, what do you, are you, uh, are you buying separate toilet paper too, or you just have your own rolls? I already had mine, I told you. That's yeah. what we had, we talked about in the very first place. Yeah, I okay, but you had your rolls and then he had his, but like, are you, are you taking the same rolls out of the same pack, or are you at both buying your own packs too? I already told you that. I have mine. Yeah. And I bought it. And I haven't bought fucking toilet paper since I got here. <laughs> yeah. Well, it's hard to tell. It's hard to tell, like, like maybe he's lapping you or, like, at what level you're at, you know? Like, really. Say what? Like, maybe he's lapping you. Like, how do you know? You don't know where you're at in the toilet paper rolls. If there's two kinds of toilet paper rolls, like, maybe one, like, like you, you show up and then it's only, like, a little bit done. But maybe you've used, like, one or two rolls since then. You come back and you've just been lapping them. With the rolls, you know what I'm saying? No, he sees what he sees. You can see my package over there on the wall. <laughs> oh, yeah, okay. And then he sees the other one that never disappeared or something. Yeah, all right. Um, That's all I can say. Is he's like, he's like, no, he sees that my package is never disappearing. And he's like, what the? Where or maybe is, just a little bit at a time. Where's your uncle now? Is he in the house? I suppose. I don't know. I don't know where he's at. Yeah. You should you know, get a bidet. In my room. Can you hear that? Freddie says get a bidet. Say what? Get a bidet. For what reason? To wipe your... Be get a cleaner. You wash your ass with water. What I need to do that for? So you don't have to buy toilet paper. Oh. Yeah. Well, I don't buy it that often. Do you care? Yeah. yeah, Mr. Ginsburg doesn't need it because he's got rabbit, rabbit turds. Um, I shit rabbit turds in my ass. You, you, like, you, you figured out your perfect diet to, so you don't have to use as much toilet paper. Yeah, something about his weird body. Um. What? <laughs> I don't know. My, no, my body eats everything I stick in there. It just gets eaten up, and jumped up. Well, and, I don't know. I don't want to. I don't want to say on the subject too much. But rabbits have a very poor digestion, actually, and like they have to eat their own poop multiple times because the first time doesn't get it all out, so they eat it more than once. Well. I don't know what to tell you. Yeah, for, uh, because rabbit, rabbits have bad digestion. Humans actually have very strong digestion. That's why our poop is so nasty, because we use it all up. Because rabbits, they eat it again because they, cause they can still get nutrients out of it. Because uh, I remember once I was at a friend's house, and they had like the rabbit just like, loose in the house. And it was pretty gross anyway, but they had let the rabbit just like, you know, like shit on the floor. And then the rabbit 
I saw the rabbit starting to eat. Eating it. Yeah, I was eating it. it I was like, ah, <laughs> you know. <laughs> but they said, no, that's how it's supposed to be. You ain't watched the Survivor show where the guy goes out and eats rabbit turds or something. <laughs> I don't know. I or, not or seen that. You, ain't, you, ain't see, you ain't seen them people um, make um, stew out of um, cow pies? Scoop? Soup. No, that's gross, though, but I guess you're trying to survive. That's right, that's right. You strain all the grass out of it, and what's left is soup. Oh, I thought you would eat the grass part only. That's gross. I don't want to talk about this anymore. <laughs> no, you strain it out. <laughs> yeah. Uh, and what's left is what you get to eat. That's gross. What What do you, um, What is, so you're, you're outside? What, what were you doing before we called you? It, it's kind of more like drinking, though. Cause it's yeah, that's too- enough. Okay, sorry. What, um, <laughs> sorry. What, what, were you, what, what were you doing before we called you? Um, I was smoking weed, yeah. and I was watching something. Watching TV? On well, the, I, can't the, 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 I can't remember what the fuck it was. On All the, that digital glitchery. Yeah, just watching like the, the, the over-the-air digital channels? Yep, yep. What was that? Watch the, the Logger channel. The Logger channel? Yeah. They have a whole channel? Well, no, the logger program on uh, one channel. Yeah, like a, what is discovery? Like lo- like backroads. Yeah, logger? something like something like that. Ice, you know. ice road logging. Ax, ax, axeman or something. Yeah. I used to be that type of guy. You were a lumberjack. I used to be. Ah, uh, I don't know. I know you were a fisherman, and a construction worker, and. Uh, you and were in the woods. I used to. Uh, I don't Tell know about, I never about the vlogging. I used to work, but I can't really tell you the other job I did. But I used to fell trees, and I used to uh, work under a shovel, and uh, then under a shovel? chase an under shovel. What did you do? Did you, like, climb the tree with, like, those spiky boots and stuff? I've done that. I can climb trees, no problem. Did you, uh, well, did problem. you have, um... I used to be able to climb trees. I have, can, probably, like the, I can the, probably do it again now, but I used to, you know... Did you wear a flannel? I did. And, uh, um... Uh, and the uh, freaking... What else, like a beard? Did you have a beard and, like, uh, maybe those hats that go over your ears? I wear my chaps under my pants. Oh, you put them under? I always thought people would wear Got the chaps over boots. the pants. Um, yeah, I wonder if I like, want... the lumberjack came from lumberjacks or it came from Monty Python. Like those... so, once once I wrecked my motorcycle. Yeah. And my boots, my boot was my foot was my boot was in between my leg, the motorcycle and the car, and. One of my eyelets on the boot got twisted around, punched back through the leather, and up, went upside down to where whenever you go to tie your boots, you had to do that one on the inside. Oh. Whoa. In- wow. But you yeah. You to save your feet, though, huh? Um, but, pardon me? I still got both feet, though. Yeah, then maybe those tough boots, they saved your feet? Yeah, they did. They say I probably lost my fingers off if I didn't have them boots on, motherfucker. What did you do? So, what did you do with the trees? Like you cut down the trees and then you put them on a truck. That's right. Was it for like harvesting trees, or was well, first, it for? Yeah, first you gotta take all the limbs off of them, and then you gotta cut them in the forty foot ten, thirty foot ten, twenty oh. ten. Was it yeah. for collecting wood, or was it for uh, like? Yard, yard stuff, or whatever. No, from, it was logging. Logging, yeah. Wow. Yeah. You, uh, with a chainsaw mostly, or did you have one? They have like these crazy clamp machines now. I fell tree down, you know, like cut them down. With a chainsaw? <laughs> chainsaw. Yeah. 
064 type, you know. Wow. Now they switch it all up. Is that I heard flannel? they just switch it. Does, the the does the flannel have a purpose? Or are you just like, you they just tell you to wear it when you're going to go cut down trees? Say that one more time. Like, is the flannel, like, tree cutters, they wear flannel all the time. But is it for a reason? Or is it just like, you just know to wear it if you're going to go cut down a tree? you just like, or is Well, it for one... It can start raining at any time. <laughs> For two, it protects you from splinters from all the sawdust blasting back at you. Don't just hit your t-shirt and go through, right? Yeah, so it is, it's like a, it is. And it's nice and warm whenever you're out there in, in the shade underneath everything. Fucking getting rained on a little bit or whatever. Yeah, so it's not just like it's a, nice a, a uniform. Yeah, yeah. I don't know. Yeah. Do you ever? You have you have some stories? Do you ever uh, almost die? Uh, I never almost died. I almost cut my foot off once, but fucking. Yeah, that that could have killed you. Yeah, well, it could have if I wouldn't have gone to a hospital. But I didn't need to go to a hospital because I didn't cut it off. Yeah, what I always carry. I, I always carry my saw. When my arms at 90 degrees, and or just a little, and that's all I can say is I always had my saw where it wouldn't it would miss my foot if I ever um, did something stupid. <laughs> and one day I did something stupid, I guess, because it went right. I had it all charged up. All on the gas and it um, something. It bounced out of your foot out the tree? I was, cut, I was cutting through a limb, and it uh, pinched on it just a little bit, but then it went cutting across the freaking uh, tree and went swinging right across my boot. Wow. But your boot, your boot stopped it? My boot stopped it. <laughs> yeah. Uh, no, um, it didn't stop it. I cut a hole in my boot. Oh. Uh, but I did, I did not. I only put a little, like, a paper cut on my foot. Wow. I think that it counts as stopping it. cut into the foot slightly, though? Just a little shave of skin. Just shaved off one little spot. Oh, you did get a little cut on your foot? Just a barely. Wow. One little spot. Yeah. But my my yeah, my boot got a freaking good, uh, like two or three inches missing out of that son of a bitch. What, Freddy? So those must be good boots. Like, what, kind of boots those? what kind of boots? Timberlands? No, they came up to halfway up your um, shin. Half, half to three quarters way up my shin. I don't know. They're expensive. They're three hundred fifty bucks or something. Login boots, huh? Yeah, yeah, cork. Oh. Well, did you, oh. you never had to save anybody's life, like when you hit, hit the construction? Never had to save nobody's life besides one guy that freaking uh, passed out whenever I was on a yeah. three, story, three stories up on the scaffolding. I've heard this story before, but when you were logging, we almost cut your foot off. Were you, oh, is that the uh, same cat? Nope. I was not nothing. I was like, it's a no, good it's thing I always guy. carry my saw where it will miss my foot. Flower? Because it Gritty. worked. The theory paid off in the long run because I took up my foot. Were you up in the tree when that happened? or? No, I was standing on a log. So when when did you, was this before or after you lived in the woods and were a fisherman? That was before I got crippled. Before you got crippled, but when did you live in the woods? After I got crippled. Oh, you did? You lived in the woods partly. afterwards? I, I, I did. Yep, yep. Did you live? I thought I you did. couldn't, yeah. I, I, did, I did partly before and after, actually. Oh, okay. And different places in between. I guess you're used to the woods if you are a uh, lumberjack used to living in the woods. That I'm used to being out there. Yeah. I don't mind it. 
Um, All right, bye, future. I'm going to record a message in the future. No. Yes. No. Yes. Do it. What time is it? Uh, 9.20. Jesus Christ, make up your mind. I got a, um, I got a new watch. It's got a, um... I uh, think it's only 9.18. My watch it does the satellite timing syncing. Wow. No, to my satellite timing says it's 9.18. Well, on your phone? That's right. Sounds like your satellite's a little slow. Um... My satellite and the, the the my phone both say 920. You're right. Mine does too. Oh, okay. <laughs> I, I, I was looking at my clock and I thought my clock was right, but it's two minutes it off. My my new watch is the satellite time, but I I got this watch like I wanted this watch for a long time, and I I got it on the internet because uh, uh but um I can't wear it out because I'm not wearing like accessories out because I don't want to have to wash them every time I come back so. Now I only oh, can wear. Oh, oh, oh. I only wear this watch right. inside the house now. <laughs> How about that? Yeah, we, we're, there's plenty of clocks and stuff. So, but it's uh, getting some use out of it anyway. You got nowhere to go. That shit, that shit might not never see the sunshine again. You saying? Yeah, well, it's solar. It's solar and does the satellite thing. So if the. Oh shit! It's solar, and so it better see the sunshine again. Yeah. This is like going to be a survival watch. This is for when the society is... Ooh, slugs? Yeah, there's slugs. How about that? Solar watch, huh? All right. Hey, I, future, it's us the past. That watch of yours would be shitting its pants in my house. Yeah, I got a watch. Mr. Ginch is on the phone. He's talking about being a lumberjack. Toilet paper. Freddy's got slugs and cats. The still going on. Some worse than ever. Um, Wacko chair over there. Oh, it was the modeling. It's in our dreams. Get it out of our dreams. Get out of my dreams. All right, bye, future. I will not get out of his dreams. No. I will. I will only be there to help you. Guide you along. How's uh, how's your work, Mr. Gintu? Are they any any outbreaks? Um, I heard somebody could have. Uh, yeah. One or two, it's hard to say. It's gonna spread through the, to the the residents, though, maybe. I miss work, fucking god damn it. Yeah, you. That was because the, the phone reception was bad. Oh, you. Yeah, I remember you said you missed work because you tried to call them and then it didn't work and then tried to call you back and. Yeah, and then my reception didn't let me fucking have a message, so I fucking didn't fucking know I could work. Yeah. Maybe but, you should. Get... I might get written up. I might get written up for it because fucking I told them I was gonna want to be there. You should get a um. You should get the internet in your home because you could hook it up to your phone and get reception for your job. Um. Yeah. Yeah. Um. Jeez. I don't know that that makes it. My, this phone that I have in my hand is one of them flippy things, flip phone things. Oh, thing. still okay. Yeah. And I don't know. so I don't think your internet is going to help it at all. Yeah. Maybe not. You gotta get yeah, that's 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 pretty far out. Um, your message today, you were talking about like birth control and stuff. Yeah, I mean, somewhere freaking. I think the Supreme Court said you have to give them uh, birth control. The that's that sounds like a good thing to me. The um. Yeah, yeah, it is. Fucking, I heard somebody said no to that shit and was like, so, I'm like, what the fuck are you doing, man? <laughs> Who and what, though? I don't know. Yeah, it's very, very broad. Uh, there's some religious, religious-eyed motherfuckers You're out still there. Trying to trying stop to stop that the even the right now? Over. They're trying to fuck the women over. Yeah. And they need to fucking stop before I fucking get pissed off. They, 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 they gotta, just want control. That's always, like, they don't care about health or even children. Yeah. Like, all this stuff. You know, they, the craziest one is, like, the same people who voted 
who are trying to like get abortion, um, get rid of abortion, also like voted against like COVID protection for kids too, to like help keep the kids safe from the virus. Like they don't actually care about the kids. They don't care about kids. They're no. a bunch of baby haters. Um, but the, uh, what's the thing is like the, uh, the uh, they think it's a hoax or the, with the kids. I don't know. Yeah. Um. That fucking sucks. Yeah. They're a bunch of assholes. Is Mike Mike you still there, or was he ever there? He was there. Is this from your yard? Freddy's got yeah. some flowers. I grew these daisies, and I picked these, like, weird purple pea flowers from uh, from my neighbor's yard. Oh. <laughs> What'd you make for dinner, Mr. Ginsu? Say what? What, what, what have what, for dinner? What's for dinner? Um, I made corn and hamburger and tamales. Oh, that sounds good. The hamburger is, like, three times the price right now. You notice that? Um, I did not. When did you buy it? Last, um, uh, month ago. A month ago? Yeah, you didn't realize that hamburger had tripled in price? Did it not triple in price? Did it go back down? I don't know. Um, For a minute I there, it tripled in price. I haven't been... It was about a month ago, last time I bought food, too, and it, I, I wasn't buying the beef because it was three times as much. I've been eating chicken. Hmm. I, I'll have to pay attention. You just don't I even know what you're spending when you buy the beef. You just you just like grabbed it and put it on your cart charger or something. Probably I better to make do sure you don't want to write fat content and then. Uh, you don't want to look at the price. No. Not really. I look at the color of the meat and the fat content. Although I know in my head inside that meat. It's not the color it is on the outside. Yeah, again, weird well, meat. The majority of the time. You don't pay attention to the price of things when you buy them? I'm trying not, not to. I used to do it a lot, I mean, but lately... You, you gotta uh, buy what you like. And what you like, Because of the virus? Or... I guess, yeah. Um, well, lately, because of the virus, and I normally... It. I don't know, I'm still just like... Too invested in the in values and numbers and stuff. I you know, love beans. I mean, it's pretty funny at the job because I like beans. Um, we're not accepting cash right now. Yeah. And I think a lot of people think that we're like telling them that money is worthless. They're like upset that they can't use uh, cash. They're like, yeah. it's money, it's cash. Like, nope, it's real. Like, you're telling me that it's not real? They're afraid it's going to go away, I think. Like, that it's not real. Yeah. Um, got to buy. Yeah, you, you got to look at the numbers on your beef, though. Uh, yeah, just buy I guess buy it if you if it's what you want, right? Like, well, because they have, the like, price. they have, like, three kinds of ground beef. So, like, how else are you going to make your decision? Like, you got to buy one of the kinds of ground beef you're looking at them. And you're like, this is this price, Quality. this one's this price. It's like, well, so which one are you going to buy? You have to decide which one you're going to buy and how do you decide which one you're going to buy if you're not looking at the price or and the and the fat content and the the brands and all that stuff you got to look at the yeah, package well, the fat like, content, this, yeah, they got where the cows are treated fat. well that's a lot of lean the, fat. Uh, fat ratio uh, you want 80 20 uh, 80 20 ground beef's the best stuff 80 20 95 5 no eight, that's anything like anything more than 80 like 90 is too little fat I don't mind less fat myself. Eighty twenty. That's the only. Eighty twenty is fine. Eighty twenty is the best. Right. Eighty twenty is correct. Um, Anything like else? Seventy thirty. Nope. Too too fatty. It, that that's is, a lot. Whenever you melted. whenever you fucking cook it, um, yeah. there becomes a puddle of grease yeah. in your pan. Yeah. Seventy thirty melts. It just melts away. Oh. 80 yeah, 20. Yeah. Then you got half the half the size it was when you started. Yeah. Or maybe even less. 80 20, you can put, like, I, I often, like, you can put, like, the grease can put get soaked into your uh, your starch. 
And uh, what you do is you take your hamburger fat and you put it in a can and you save it up till you got a gallon of it. Then you can pour it in your diesel and have uh, bio diesel. Bio diesel, <laughs> yeah. You can just pour run, your car runs on hamburgers. You can pour. You can just pour it straight from the pan into the engine. And don't you need to have like a special engine for that? No, you need a filter for the fucking oil. Yeah. You can filter the oil and then put it in your fucking rag. But you could just put hamburger grease right into the car. <laughs> sure. Don't you need? You don't need it's to like refine it somehow, it's or don't oil. you need like a special kind of engine for that? Well. Yes and no. Not no. No. Not a special engine. Um, they want you to have a special uh, filter for your filtering it before yeah, it hits the you're engine. Get the, the big chunks. They want to make sure all the big chunks of fucking uh, cow are gone. Yeah. <laughs> I thought you got to do something with it, but uh, I usually end up eating that grease anyway because I, I soak it up with like rice or something. Yeah, me too. Yeah. Unless it's, it's, your unless it's iron, you know, if you and then there's just like a half a cup there, so you just say, fuck that, and pour it up. Yeah, yeah, eighty twenty though, but I, I don't know why you don't look at the price. I mean, we went back down the, but uh, the meat the meat industry is having, getting hit pretty hard by the virus, I guess. That's why it was so expensive. I, yeah, I do feel like I've been less uh-huh. prices, less prices lately. I haven't gone to the store, so maybe I'm even looking at the prices even more than I was before because I'm like, it's mm. all, I, but, yeah. uh, um, yeah. Well, let's see. I want to call my grandmother, Mr. Ginsu. Okay. Hey, take it easy, man. All right. Well, thanks for talking. It's good to hear from you because it's hard to get a hold of you, so check your phone. I can leave some messages, and hey, take it easy, Freddie, and whoever else hey, is on the phone, and the internet, and whatnot. We're here at 8... <laughs> Well, if you're here at 8.45 to 9.45 every day, so that's when you should be checking reception, okay? Okay, right. there you go. Okay, bye. Later. Hey, I got some exciting news. Um, the Feel the Drive show, which is on Wednesdays, is on Chaos again. It was, like, my favorite thing on Chaos. The Dominica show? Yeah, it's back today. Online? Today's the first day, in half an hour. It's like she's doing online now? Um, it's still on chaos, but I think yeah, she's making the mix. She's like doing it from home. Yeah, that's good. The, the uh, chaos people are like faking it, you know. They're like they're like making a mix where they're live and talking and stuff. And yeah. I'm calling grandma, and then we try to call Mark, the guitar player too. Nice. Wednesday. Wednesday's like the slowest Hi, day Jenny. at work. Hi, Grandma. How are you? Good, how are you? I'm okay. I'm not thinking nobody here right now. Yeah, I'm calling to talk to you. <laughs> you know what? Yeah. What? See how you're doing. Check on you. Yeah, I'm, I'm okay. Good. I'm by myself. Yeah. Can I do something? Yeah. Yeah. You drinking water? Yeah, I take it. All right, well, that's why I'm calling you. I mean, the, no people are staying away from each other because of the virus. So I'm calling you maybe to help you get lonesome a little bit, but on the phone. Yeah, okay. Yeah. You uh, you, you, you have water on right now? Yeah. So when he come back, they come back, they're going to call you back. How that? Yeah, that sounds good. But you have water out right now? Yeah. You I do? I try to. Well, what about okay, right? I go I go and drink the water now. Yeah. You okay, thank for call. Okay, okay, go get yeah, okay. go get the water. Okay. When I gonna see you? Soon, pretty soon. Okay. Okay. I look you forward to see you. You too. Okay, take care. You too. Okay, bye. Okay, bye. That reminds me, I should drink some water right now. Everyone, Gotta drink, drink the water. Water. It's hard to drink the water. Um. With the masks, because you got to figure out like when, when you're gonna when you're gonna do it, and you got to like wash your hands real good, and like take a spot where you can like find a sanitized spot, like clean your spot, do the whole thing, take a sip, and do it back up, like, like a yeah, it's a crazy world. Uh, the straws straws make it easier, but it's like also just yeah, you also it, you basically need like a five minute window almost 
to yeah. the, or like a couple minute window to drink water because you can't have customers. I guess you're not with customers anyway, maybe, but like you still we're, you still can't do it. Like you still gotta like yeah. sanitize like real hard before the yeah. All right, I'm gonna call Mark the guitar player. Maybe we should have kept Mr. Gintz on the phone for long. We got ten minutes left still. He could have gone. gone. What? Yeah. He could have gone on forever. <phone rings> What'd you eat for dinner? I uh, actually got um, some pizza. From old school? No, it was um, like brick stone or something, or like wood stone, wood fired pizza. Over I'm okay. Day. Like cheap farm stand. Yeah. Yeah. Stuff good. I remember that place. You cannot leave a message for three, six, I can't. zero. I'll show you. Hey, Mark. I'm talking to you. This is a message for you in the future if you're watching this on TV. It's a message. Hi, showed you, machine person. Um, we're back on TCTV. I looked at it last night. At 11.30. Yeah, we're back at 11.30. I didn't look at 2 a.m. though, but I did look at 11.30, and we're back on the right day, too. Yeah, two AM is easier because two AM we still have to convert in like the, the like crazy way to get the two AMs to work. So the fact that eleven thirty worked is like the big test because oh, okay, now we yeah. know that it worked. We don't need to like yeah. That's that's amazing. That means the eleven thirty should I got I turned in files all the way through um, August third, so Wow. And they're all labeled to be on the right date, so how yeah, how's the pizza? Oh, pretty good. We got um, white sauce with chicken, and um, the crust is, like, really soft, and they salt the crust in a really nice way, so the, the crust is, like, kind of salty. Yeah, um, it's soft? And it's really soft. I don't know. It, it was kind of refreshing. You know, I guess, like, I always forgot that there was other kinds of pizza other than old school. Yeah. Soft. So, yeah, like soft. Chewy? And, like... No, not chewy, but like, like, flaky and soft somehow. Soft. I don't know. I'm mean, not a man. It seems like soft is undercooked to me, but it's not undercooked. No, it's definitely not undercooked. It's like a, it's like a texture, not a like a like a pie like doughy, like huh? an actual pie, kind of flaky. No, no, no. That's like dry and hard, like crunchy and flaky. It's yeah. not like that. It's like um, soft and flaky, huh? <laughs> got to be its own thing it's not, it's not like vix is softer than old school yeah i had vix not too long ago too because someone got like a someone got some and gave me a piece and uh yeah it was fine i'm not too into vix i think old school is really good this this brickstone place is awesome i like it yeah i used to go to the brickstone place like the people that owned it used to go to parties like a long time ago Oh, cool! Yeah, yeah. you would like, go to a house party, and they would just be there, and they they did like festivals and stuff too. Yeah. Are you are you looking at the YouTube? Uh, no, I'm not. Oh well, I'm gonna look at Why? a couple of messages to the future. Oh, that sounds good. Um, here, uh, I can I can look at it if I wait. I better get a good face. I gotta. It's gonna freeze. It's yeah. gonna freeze my video. So I gotta like. Oh yeah, there you go. On. Well, it's gonna um, override it with the um, messages anyway. But uh, we can take a look real fast if you want to do it on purpose. What day is today? Wednesday. Yeah. How far are we going back? Uh, one week. And then uh, I think that's gonna be it for the program today. Look at the last week since it was... Oh, yeah, Wednesday. Last Wednesday was the day that Robert Campbell was there. But I'm going to stop it so we can take a look at your what you did for the freeze frame for a second. There it is. Look at your freeze frame. Oh, I can see my freeze frame on the actual thing. Oh, there it is. I'm frozen. Yeah. That's pretty nice. Yeah. Hey, yeah, that's better future. than some. A lot of them are like... Yeah, hey, it's you. us to the past. What do you have to say to the future? <laughs> I'll have to say, are we still doing karaoke only and dance only dance every Friday? Probably. Oh yeah, good question. Um, we're also, um, you know, we're living here in the, in the present. Thank you. We talked to Dan Bennett and uh, Paul Anthony, the Canadians for Canada Day. Uh, all right. Thanks, future. All history is like 
dark history. Yeah, how far in the future are we going here? When do you check this? About a week now. Bye. Bye. All the way, Robert. Hey, future, test the past. What's up? What's up? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we're quite team. We're looking at Steve's uh, animals. He's got a famous cat and a lizard and a uh, real cute that, dog. Six days ago. <laughs> Alex is with the mountain barter on uh, the phone. I'm Bye, future. <laughs> Bye. Bye. Hey, future, it's us, the past. Uh, look, it's uh, Danso Dance. Whoa. Robert. Danso Dance now? To Robert's yeah. house and uh, <laughs> other places, too. And they're all, it's all, Robert's got three cameras going all at once. He's just dancing yeah, in, in his own room. Robert on three. Uh, it's all on the third drive. It's like the fourth drive. It's like the fourth drive. It's like the same period. It's like the same I don't know, I guess I don't know I if I had to, but I felt kind of compelled because like, Robert like called me and he's like, Yeah, I don't know anything right now, so I did that again. Uh, what, Freddy? Yeah, it's Friday, I'm alive, okay, bye. I feel like we got rid of Dance to Dance and, and now it's like taking over someone else, you know? It hey, took a lot of effort. Hey, future, it's us the past. Yeah. Now somebody else is doing it. It's like who? Jason from Jason Goes to Hell. It's the 4th of July. Yeah, exactly. Kinda, yeah. <laughs> technically because... You know what I'm talking about. Or is this the 4th of July? Just like the 3rd of July. Uh, we made it though. Why throughout history? Uh, the YouTube's getting weird. Grandma got drink water. My dad went to Grandma's house today. Uh, oh yeah. Okay, bye future. Uh, what's that thing from Independence Day of the movie? You know me. Hey future, it's us, the past. That's what I'm talking about. Hey, Fisher, we're all going to die, and we're fucked. Goodbye. <laughs> yeah. Yep. Uh, Jackson and Andrew are barbecuing. All right, bye. Yeah. Oh, bye. Bye. Hey, future. Hello, future. James. Oh, wow, that was I'm a good episode. Sorry. This, go this one was really good. <laughs> yeah, yeah. James comes Hi. back has a lot to say. James is back. James, don't do math in the future. To the future. Don't do math in the future. Should we I call James? Tell him not to do math. But I will do my best. Okay. No promises. It's a Monday. Promise. Promise. Okay, yeah, bye, future. <laughs> he didn't want to promise not to do math. Hey, uh, he knows about promises. Uh, he's promised before. Oh, you yeah, know? yeah, yeah. Cincinnati spaghetti. It's not good, but it's food. Uh, food push up. It was gross. Pop. I didn't We're even. I, I threw it away. She's reading the book. Birds oh, oh, oh. How's the Cincinnati pizza spaghetti. Oh, I actually ate oatmeal this morning. Oatmeal yep. with peanut butter, like, because I it was out of food. Oh, for oh, pizza. You did? How was it? It was right, fine. It was just like you said. Um, I ate some oatmeal. Yeah. Yeah, rice and beans is like way better hey, than the oatmeal hey, peanut butter. Hey, future, it's us the past. Yeah. That watch of yours would be shitting its pants in my house. Yeah, I got <laughs> what? Mr. Ginch is on the phone. He's talking about being a lumberjack. Toilet paper. Freddy's got <laughs> slugs <laughs> and cats. A weird thing to say out of context, That's Mr. Ginch. Still going on. Some... Worst never. Um, Wacko shit over there. Oh, it was the modeling. It's in our dreams. Get it out of our dreams. Get out of my dreams. All right, bye, future. All right, well, we're getting down to only about two minutes left. Um, what were we just saying? Uh, we were talking again about the, what do you call it? Um, peanut butter and... Oh, peanut butter, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. rice and beans is way better than the peanut butter. Like, I, I ate some peanut butter and oatmeal, but, like... Rice and beans feels better. It's probably just as cheap. Takes longer. You got to prep it though. It's also like probably a more complete protein. I mean, well, I like peanut butter is pretty good for you. Yeah, well, peanut butter the, fatty. Uh, I think maybe I just overdid it on the oatmeal though. I was for a while there. I was eating like a lot of oatmeal. Peanut butter. See, I, you I, sick. Don't know. I, I had what? it this morning because it was like brec it's breakfast food. It's like if you're eating it not at breakfast time, it's not that good. It's also Last like week, it, it made you sick. Bad. It made me what? sick too. That one day when I was eating, like I got sick, 
Uh, I ate yeah. peanut butter oatmeal and potatoes, and I got sick. Oh, is that a thing? What? Which peanut? Are you eating the peanut butter out of the cupboard? Is it the peanut butter from the cupboard? Are you talking to someone in the peanut gallery? Yeah, China said that the peanut butter and oatmeal made her sick last week. And on the day that I got sick last week, I was also eating a lot of peanut butter and oatmeal. But I also ate the old potatoes at the same time. It was a bad combination, though. I was like, I knew like I didn't have that many potatoes. That's why I ate those old potatoes, because I didn't have that many left. So I wanted to eat the rest of them. But then I knew that I needed more food, so I ate a little bit of peanut butter and oatmeal, too. So I got, and it made me uh, get sick. Um, the one thing I can say about peanut butter and oatmeal that I feel like you said was that because I was not really enjoying it, like it was definitely like it was food for the sake of nutrients. I yeah. ate it really slow, and then it I like didn't overeat, and it was nice. Yeah, and then it's like, like takes a while because then you're you're not like you don't feel satiated, but that feeling of being hungry is gone. Yeah, you don't, definitely. You don't, you, don't like, you don't like get the feeling of like being full. But you're yeah. like to neutral, which is where you actually should be, because you should never be like, "Oh, I feel like I ate something," you know. Yeah. You should never actually get to that point. You should always be at like, not hungry, but also not like feeling like you could feel the food. Because so you're you're eating if it. You, uh, if you're, oh yeah. Like, I could go Keep for eating some, everybody. Eat, I could eat, go eat, for more of this. Water. But then you're like, after about ten minutes, then you then you kind of forget about that anyway, because then. It's, Cause it's like oh, it's like not even like when you're hungry, you know. It's not like your body needs food. It's like you're getting these like signals that you want to eat in your like hormones or something. You know, they're telling you to eat the yeah. food, and then when you when you have your stomach is full, or you have enough food, it takes like a good like ten minutes for those like brain chemicals to move around. There's like you've got your brain in your guts or something. You know about that? Mm-hmm, I've heard of that. So it's like the gut brain takes a while. It's, stu- it's stupid. Stupid gut it's stupid, brain. It's it, knows, it knows some things better, though. Yeah. But it's you like... Trust you trust your gut. You gotta wait. You gotta wait. It takes... It's slow. It's pretty slow. Right. Not slow like thinking. you're up, up here, your brain's real fast. Fast brain. Alright. Yeah. We made it. That's the show. Yeah, it hey, is. Hey. Listen to uh, Feel the Drive on Chaos. Wednesdays at 10 p.m., 89.3 FM. It's like the best hour of radio on chaos for sure, guaranteed. We're on TCTV Channel 22, 1130 and 2 a.m. Check it out, yeah, what is it should be on dot com. 360-836-1384, call me message, get on TV, yeah. Watch the credits on YouTube, bye. Bye, what well, did I do? You know, I'll stay on so I can say bye. Okay, Graham Graham was a good song, thank you. TCTV, the baby, Jordy Fabulous, Graham Graham, South Spike Hunter, I'm up there, Smith County, watch the state USA, thank you, and viewers as you're watching, thank you. Hell yeah, dog! Hell yeah. Bye. Bye.